Over there behind me is a big hedge. In the gap between the two hedges is the pull-up area of Goodwood Racecourse. You can't see the racing from here, but up there on Trundle Hill, you get one of the best free vantage points over any racecourse in Britain. And many people enjoy a day at Goodwood Races without being at Goodwood Races from Trundle Hill. Let's meet a few of them. So among the race goers up here on Trundle Hill, we've got Shirley, Jenny, Jim, and were Dave there, that would be his seat. That is Dave's position. Where has Dave gone? I don't know, he's upgraded by the bookies, I should say. Rather better now, definitely. Okay, and now, ladies, how, how long have you been coming up to Trundle Hill for? About five years. And what do you like about it, Jenny? The view up here is much better. Also, as well, up here is presumably much more cost effective. Yes, exactly, yeah. And so, sort of what have you brought to nibble on during the day? Cheese rolls, pork pie, crisps. I, I know, Jenny, you've not brought anything sweet, but Shirley, you've got a devilish little face there. What, if, what has Shirley brought? <laughs> Flap, flapjacks. <laughs> Jenny? Will you be having any of the flapjacks? No, 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 no. She'll be saying no to that then when I offer. <laughs> well, Trundle Hill attracts plenty of regular return visitors. Two of them are here, Nick and Alan. Alan, how many years have you been coming to Trundle Hill? Uh, at least 35, probably a little bit more. And over those 35 years, how has this place changed? It's a lot quieter than it used to be, but um, it's uh, as long as you've got the sunshine, like today, it's it's the same every year. Obviously, the race course is all laid out there in front of you, but watching that first race, there's sort of tiny little dots in the distance. Can you actually see anything that's going on? If you've got these, you can uh, see everything. Well, there's no doubt who the most important race goers on Trundle Hill today are. They are the three A's. Yes, Amy. Hello, Amy. Hello there. Alexandria. Hello. And Anne. Hello. And you are so important because it's Alexandra's, what, well, you're about to celebrate. My 70th birthday. On? On Monday the 6th of August. Monday the 6th of August. And so you've come here for a day at Trundle Hill. So like an early part of the celebrations. Early, early part. Well, I started at Sandown just... Almost a week ago. Right. Okay. And the, this, the festivities have moved on to here. Yes. What have you What have you sort of um, consumed today? <gasps> oh, um, a bottle okay. of Nicolas Fouli champagne. Yes. Almost a bottle of Sauvignon Blanc, and we have another bottle of Sauvignon Blanc, just ready in case we run out. Okay. Um, and you're about to have the trifles, and then Anne, you've made a cake, haven't you? I have. What cake is it? Fruit. Fruit, like a conventional old-fashioned fruit cake. Yes, marvellous. Um, and in terms of a day here on Trundle Hill, yeah. Amy, what do you so love about it? I love the views. I, I love the people on a sunny day. Everybody is so happy. It's just a pleasure to come here. And um, you also want to give a plug, don't you, to your local bowling club? Yes, Holloway Hill Bowling Club in Godalming. We're all wonderful and a happy family. And that's the first ever bowling plug on RPTV. So lots of people here having a great time on Trundle Hill and some of them have got cake. So have I, thanks to Anne. It's very good indeed.